Well, researchers are unveiling a promising new treatment option for people being affected by Crohn's disease and other related conditions, and it's all with the help of artificial intelligence. CTV Scott Hurst joins us live mm -hmm. with more on this. Scott, good morning. What can you tell us about this new treatment? Good morning, Nick and Jen. Some promising medical news. And Nick, if I'm not mistaken, you'll greatly appreciate this. Researchers at... McMaster University, am I right? With the, help of, uh, <laughs> with the help of other researchers at MIT have really made two promising medical breakthroughs at once. They not only discovered a brand new antibiotic that targets inflammatory bowel diseases, but also successfully used a new type of AI to predict exactly how the drug works. And to their knowledge, that is a global first for AI. So first, let's focus on the diseases, inflammatory bowel diseases, the most common being Crohn's and colitis. And listen, here in Canada, it has one of the highest rates of Crohn's and colitis in the world. So the stakes are high. So that's what brings us to the first breakthrough, the brand new antibiotic. Most antibiotics used in clinics are broad spectrum drugs, meaning they wipe out good bacteria in addition to those that cause disease. But the new antibiotic discovered at McMaster is a narrow spectrum drug, meaning it attacks only a specific group of disease causing bugs. According to researchers, the new drug is really a promising treatment candidate that ultimately could help alleviate symptoms and that would provide a much higher quality of life for so many people suffering right now. And that's good. And, you know, a more targeted treatment mm -hmm. sounds, you know, like you said, the way you described it sounds really promising. Scott, how did AI help? Yeah. And what does that mean for researchers? We talk a lot about the negative impacts of AI. This sounds like a very positive impact. Yeah, we can focus in on the AI aspect of this now. Researchers say the development of the new drug has been fast-tracked thanks to the collaboration between humans and artificial intelligence. Drug developers spend a significant amount of time and money trying to figure out a new drug's mechanism of action or how it kills bacteria. MOA studies often take years to complete and can cost millions of dollars. Now, as the principal investigator pointed out, instead of years, they made the initial prediction in less time than it takes to get a cup of coffee. So using AI, this group completed a thorough MOA study in just six months at just $60,000. So this could prove to be quite a leap in medical research. Now, to be fair, this is ultimately my breakdown in layman's terms, but it is a promising development that could impact the lives of so many Canadians. Mm -hmm, yeah. More significant than any research I ever did at Mac, I can tell you <laughs> that. Yeah. Yeah. Incredible stuff. Okay, CTV Scott Hurst joining us live this morning. Thank you, Scott. Thanks, Scott. Thanks, guys.